This video is uh, Visio 2003-2007 Electrical Systems Drawing Part 6 Placing and Saving Device Symbols. Uh, this is the drawing as we left it uh, before and uh, at this stage we're going to actually place the symbols. But before doing that we're going to save the symbols and uh, form called a stencil. A stencil approximately corresponds to it uh, in the days of manual drafting. Somebody might have a plastic stencil with shapes looking like a fire alarm horn or a fire alarm smoke detector. So uh, we call that a stencil. So the first thing we'll do here is go to the view menu and look at the shapes window. This is oriented towards stencils. And we'll go up to file, uh, shapes, and we're going to go down here and we're going to do a new stencil. And that uh, puts it right here. I'm going to right click on that and um, we'll see where it says save as. Here's where we get to name it. I'm going to call it uh, fire alarm. And we will save it. Now you can see that it's given this the title fire alarm. Now, uh, what we do here is we'll take the shapes and we'll copy them into the stencil, and uh, that way they'll we'll be able to save them. And so the first thing we do is take the heat detector, move it over here. I'm going to hold down the control key in order to copy it. I'm going to keep it on the drawing, and then I'm going to rename it in here uh, heat. smoke detector and finally the strobe and one other thing we're going to want to get here is the legend. And here we're going to take this thing over as a group so that when we uh, remove them, take them out here to copy them onto a drawing, they'll come just like this, all lined up and everything. So I'm going to drag that over and again hold down the control key. And we're going to call this one uh, legend. And that pretty much completes uh, saving these stencils. To right click on this and I'm going to save. Then our future drawings will be able to uh, just go up and, and find that stencil. So right now I'm going to close the stencil since we already have the, the shapes on the drawing. And just to show you how we find that in the future, we'd open the shapes window, we'd go to file, uh, shapes, my shapes. And here we would see fire alarm. And all you have to do is uh, click on that and it'll open those shapes, bring them right back into this window. Now uh, we want to place the symbols. And we'll go up here and uh, do a little sample kind of thing. So I'm going to uh, take a pull station. here near this door. And zoom in on that a little bit so I can place it the way I want. I'm going to put that right by this door. Okay, and I'm going to take a uh, heat detector.
horn right here. In order to place these uh, regularly through the building, what I can do is just copy the ones in this room and then take them from room to room. You can see there's a difference in the floor plan, so we're not getting this in the bathroom. So I'll copy this over here. But then we're going to change the layout of it. For right now, I'm just going to copy it to rooms and have this same layout. And I'll take this layout here. Heat detector to the bathroom. And select all of these. And then I'll go for this other type of room. And that's basically uh, how we do that. Now, after we do that, we want to uh, continue this uh, through the whole building. And when we've got the building complete, we'll go and work on uh, changing the data fields. And we'll do that in the next uh, video.